In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a CV or resume in MS Word. So I just opened a new Word document, a blank one, and now I'm going to create a CV. And the first thing that I'm going to do is to insert the shape, so the rectangle, and first we make it like this. So this is just an example. You can change it uh, like how you want to, but this is just for the demo and uh, I hope this will help you. Let's drag it down. And now I'm going to change the, the color and the outline, so shape fill. And I want to make it like this, and no outline. Okay, so this is the first step. Now I'm going to insert another shape, rectangle again, do it like this. Drag it a bit so it's fully covered. And I want to remove the outline. And this one is going to be black, like this. So the next step is to add another rectangle. And I want to change the order of this one. So this one needs to go to the back. So I right click it and send to back. And then I want to put this one to the back. So send to back. And now it's looked like this. And I'm going to use the base colors for my resume or CV. So I'm going to change this one. I select it, shape fill. And I want to uh, use this color. And now we're going to add a name over here. So the name of the person uh, from the resume. So here you can go to insert, shapes, and here you will see a text box. And then you can drag and drop it, and it will look like this. So let's say uh, the name of the person is Jason McDoxy, like this. And the person is a web designer. Yeah, this doesn't look uh, very nice, so now we're going to change it. So now you can select the part that you want to change. So name in this example, then I go to home, and I want to make it bigger. So I think uh, around 36, and the color needs to be white. I want to have MacDoxy around, I think 28 for now, and the color needs to be like this blue so it's the same as uh, over here now we're going to remove the background so select uh, the text bar area go to shape format shape fill and no fill and now it looks like this so drag it a bit make it slightly bigger and here we have the web designer text and i want to make that white so like this make it a bit bigger and also bold and now I want to center the text, so I select it, and here you can center it and put it in the middle. So now we have the name on the resume, we're going to add a picture. And for that you need to go to insert, over here, pictures, this device, or you can use a stock image. And now I want to use this picture, and I'm going to put it on the background so I can drag it. And here we have the picture, this is... Uh, the guy that wants to uh, make his uh, resume and to make it round you need to select the picture then you go to picture format over here crop and here you can choose crop to shape and i want to make it a circle and you can change the shape from here make it slightly bigger so a bit like this and then i'm going to put it on the front And what I also want to do is I want to have this black part in the back of this part. So I'm going to select this, uh, this one, send to back, move this a bit. And now we're going to put the picture on this place. So, so this is uh, Jason. I think this needs to be slightly bigger, so like this. And then we can make the picture a bit bigger, this one also. Now we're going to add a profile part, so insert, shapes text box and we're going to put it over here and the name is profile and I want to make this a heading this can be smaller we remove the shape fill so no fill and also the outline so no outline and then I want to have this bold and also bigger and the text needs to be black so it matched with the theme so now we have the profile part and the next thing is to add a line so we go to insert, shapes, line, and you need to hold the shift key to make it straight. 
and then you can make it a bit bigger underneath shape format and we're going to change the color so shape outline and I want to make it the same color as over here and over here and here you can add some text so insert shapes text box and now we're, I'm going to add some demo text and I want to remove the background so shape fill no fill remove the shape outline so now we have the text for the profile now we're going to add the next part so you can copy the profile text the line doesn't want to so we're going to add that manually and we're going to add a line and this needs to be contact and here you can put a phone number so so it's just uh, for the demo uh, an email address if you want to and maybe a country and you can also add icons if you want to and now we're going to add education so insert shapes text box you can uh, add a line next to it if you want to to make it a bit more attra attractive uh, like this and here we're going to add some text besides that we also want to show the experience so you can copy this experience and we copy this text box and now you can add your experience and the next thing is to add some skills so we copy this one call it skills so you can do it like this you can also add a skill with a bar so like this for example So this is 100% and then you can add the part that shows how many percent you are skilled. So shape. And we do it like this. So it could be something like this. And then you get skill B, C, D. You can also add uh, hobbies if you want to. So from here. Hobbies. And when you are done you can go to file. Save as. And then the location where you want to save it. And here you can save it as a PDF. And when you are done, it will look something like this. So now you need to add the lines over here, like I did next to education. And this is how to create your CV or resume in MS Word. Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if the video is helpful for you. And I'll see you in the next one.